find out the computers with the pending restart. So what are we trying to achieve here? In this case, uh, so uh, when you go through the console, you might sometimes see alerts. And when you go into detail, you see that uh, restart is pending because uh, there was a module update or maybe there was a, a virus detection and in order to clean it properly, we need a restart or something like that in nature. So where, wherever there's a pending restart, how do we want to act upon it? So what if we can get all the machines with a pending restart to a single uh, dynamic group? So then we know all the machines that we have to restart. Then we have two choices. One is we can actually put a, a automatic task on it so that uh, whenever a machine joins that dynamic group, it will automatically get restarted. Number two, you can choose to uh, display a message to the user so that the user will uh, restart uh, the machine whenever possible. And number one is not that preferred. Number two is the preferred method because uh, number one, uh, you might be restarting the machine while a user is working. So if number one is the preferred way, then uh, what you have to do is there's a way that you can find out the machine is idling or not. So now you, we can uh, find out the machines which needs a restart as well as which are idling. Then in that case, we can uh, push a remote restart. So that will be fine. Else uh, you can choose to display a message to the end user. Let me go to computers. Sorry. Let me create a dynamic group. I will uh, name it pending restart. Then go to template. New template. Again pending restart. Expression. So I can't remember where it is. I will just say restart. Uh, restart required. Active, it's under active detections. Okay. Restart required. Yes. Equals yes. So that's the rule. So dynamic group is completed. Right now we have the pending machines with pending restart here. Let's see. I refresh in again. No machines. Okay. So how to display a message? That's under tasks. So I'll go to task. I'll see where I can get a message. Display a message under operating system. So now I'm going to create a client task to display a message and uh, display restart required. So you can set up a title. Like the description says, this will be uh, displayed as one of OS notifications. So in a similar manner, Okay, summary. Right. Now the task is created. Finish. At the create uh, trigger point, display restart required message. Now to whom we are going to show it? To the machines that are in the pending restart dynamic group okay now click finish sorry uh, i didn't configure the trigger trigger should be as soon as joining the group okay anyways uh, you get the message uh, that's the first way i can configure that second way is if i'm going to run the restart task i cannot do it while the user is working on the machine so I have to find out whether the machine is idling. 
then only I can uh, do a remote restart. So how am I going to do it? I'm going to move dynamic group templates. I'm going to edit the pending restart. Now under expression, previously I detected that is the restart is required. Now I want to know whether machine is in idle state. Is idle. Right? So if these both of these conditions are true, then only I am going to restart the machine. So next what I am going to do is I am going to task uh, client task then under operating system I have the shutdown computer. It's under shutdown computer you will find the restart button as well. So go to a client task shutdown computer is selected under settings you choose to reboot. If you take off the tick it will shut down the computer. If you put the tick, it will reboot the computer. Okay, finish. Now create a trigger. Uh, trigger is restart the computer. Continue. Add groups. Add my dynamic group pending restart. Okay and trigger as soon as join the dynamic group. So the moment a computer joins this, uh, the machine will be restarted. So I don't want to put any throttling on that. So let's finish. Task is created.